When you need advice, come to Ben and Kelly. It's group therapy on 99.7 DJX. All right. Good morning, Heather. Good morning. Okay. So thanks for allowing us to reach out and talk to you about this. Will you tell us what's going on? Well, so six months ago, um, I met a great guy um, that I'll call Joe. <laughs> okay. Um, Joe. Things Got have it. gotten... <laughs> Um, things have gotten pretty serious. We've actually even talked about moving in together. Okay. Um, but a couple of weeks ago, Joe spent the weekend at my place and when I like, I was getting up to, you know, make breakfast. Mm -hmm. I was shocked because he walked through my door to get my paper and he was stark naked. Oh, oh, not right. Yeah. <laughs> Morning, yeah. Joe. Hi there, Joe. Yeah. <laughs> Hi, little Joe. <laughs> yeah. I, I be. yeah. At that time, yeah. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I live in, uh, <laughs> I live, you know, in a wooded area and I have a few neighbors and, but Joe, like he had to walk down my driveway, which oh. is the long one. And. Oh, he's fully outside naked? Well, yeah, you have to go to the end of my driveway. Oh. Oh, oh so this oh, yeah. was this was more than just open the front door, grab the newspaper naked. No, he's walking uh, down the long driveway. Which we've all yeah. done, thank no, you very much. No, we have not, Ben Davis. Come no, on. we have not. Come on. We have I, not. I'm not the only one with my hand up who's you done are. that. You walk through um, your house no, all the time naked. We know that. So. It's a long driveway, and it goes to a public street to get... Yeah. No robe, no nothing. No, nothing. And like anyone could have seen him because on top of it, it was raining and cold outside. So <laughs> like, what in the world. Yeah. And it's cold and raining outside. And oh. I asked him, like, why did you go outside naked in the rain? And he just kind of drugged it off like it's no big deal. Um, and he said he didn't <laughs> want to get his clothes wet. Like, what? He didn't want to get sense. his clothes wet, so he got naked to walk to the end of the street to get the paper. All and right. he couldn't just wait until later? I mean, it's your house and your newspaper. I don't understand Thank why he felt you. like right Thank now and you. then I got to go out and do this naked in the rain. I, I can't stop thinking about it. Like, I'm considering breaking up with him over this, but... Okay. You know, like I live in a small town. Like I can't risk my reputation by being in a relationship with a local flasher. Like, oh yeah, I didn't even think about like this day and age. He walks out there nude. Yes. I mean, some yeah, you're right. You're right. What if a kid I is know, like I driving know. by in a car or something, or walking say, by? Yeah. yeah, no, I it, exactly. Well, so, and I, it's like. <laughs> How am I making a huge deal out of this? Or no, like... that's weird. We all agree that's weird. But I, I feel as though you need to say, "Hey, you know, uh, thanks for getting the paper. Just want to let you know, though." And I think you explained to him, "Listen, we got I got neighbors, and you know, yeah. so maybe we don't walk outside naked." Yeah, I was going to say, I feel like there's if... kids around or whatever. <laughs> Heather, if I would have done that myself, my wife would have immediately gone. What are you doing? Exactly. And so, do you, you have the right to say that? <laughs> yeah, like, what are you doing? Yeah. I mean, like, we've gotten, you know, it's gotten serious, but I'm not to that point. I just was like, uh, I yeah, guess okay. I was so taken aback by it, you yeah. know? Like, who does that? Right. I'm assuming you like how he looks naked. That's not the issue. I mean, I... Yeah, no. That's I don't know if yeah. you or okay. Kelly know what happens to a man's body when it's cold and rainy out. We know. We I, understand. I, I, yes. But he obviously is very comfortable with himself to be <laughs> able to, to subject his body and his anatomy to the, those types of conditions. It's one thing if he's yeah. walking around the house like that, but he's walking outside. That right. is so the Heather, big Heather problematic wants to part. Know, Heather wants to know where to move on with this. How, how, do, how do you address it? I think, or undress it. <laughs> 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 I, 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 think, I think, yeah, what Kelly said. And by the way, there are plenty of people that are texting in right now. 502-795-1997. I no, we're not sending pictures. <laughs> <laughs> we need photos. We need photos, yeah, I didn't get any photos of that. I'm sorry. Uh, all right. Okay. All, right. all right. But, but yes, a, hey, 
there are kids, so let's cool it on the on the naked outside exhibitionist sort of stuff. Yeah, um, but but I got neighbors. They but, might see stuff, and you know that they don't need to see. I also understand that you're not a prude, and you know it. it certain no. things are good, and certain let's things. Let's keep are. the naked to the house. Let's keep that <laughs> yes. indoors. Yeah, got it. Yes, please. All right. Please. Well, uh, Heather, like I said, we got a lot of people that are chiming in on this, so um, he should react like, "Oh yeah, no, 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 okay, that's cool." Yeah. He should react that way. If he doesn't, I'm then. Hoping. Then we might have to reevaluate again. Yeah, that's the red flag. And I'll be calling you back, I guess. I was going to say, right. keep us posted. All right. Thank you. It. Yes. I will. All right. Heather, thank you so much. Thank you. All right. Another Heather. Well, I'm assuming it's another Heather. <laughs> I, I don't think that she'd be calling in to comment <laughs> on her own scenario uh, after we just spoke to her. Yeah, that's true. Um, Heather says, uh, definitely not something to break up over, especially if you really like the guy. Um, I guess uh, I'm not really I, seeing the big deal over there. Yeah, this. she I mean, says she honestly, says she lives in a wooded area. If and you're you can't confident, really, yeah, enough to walk down the driveway naked. More power to you, Joe. Okay. Well, Chris that's kind of what I thought too. I was like, wow, all right. He's... Chris is like, buy him a robe for Christmas. Mm. And Candy's like, cancel your subscription. <laughs> Just stop getting cancel the paper, and then he won't have a reason to walk down the driveway naked. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I. I'm just thinking of wow, um, he did that. Like, I know that is that is bold. Like well, I don't. I that just, takes some big ones. Possibly. All right. What's <laughs> what's your advice? What's your story? Do you have something um, uh, that you can relate to this? And Heather five zero two seven nine five one ninety nine seven. I didn't down the driveway naked to snag the paper. She was shocked to put it lightly. Uh, and she's like, hey, is this a red flag or how does she even approach it with him? Because she's so shocked by it that she's like, do I need to dump this guy? Is this guy like a like, what's the deal? Exactly. So <laughs> what do we do now? Is this a deal breaker or is it not? Lisa said I dated a naked guy made me very uncomfortable, but it wasn't a deal breaker. As long as he's not pushing you to be naked all the time. Don't worry about it. Maybe set some boundaries, all that stuff on Facebook. Uh, got a message from Emily that said, hey, I have no ad- advice, but thank you for the great laugh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not laughing at you. I guess I'm laughing with him. Right. Um, yeah. Uh, what about you, Dave? Okay. So first of all, I want to know what kind of boomer energy she has to still have a paper subscription. For one. <laughs> a lot of people are mentioning that. <laughs> but, <laughs> what kind of boomer energy? Yes, I'm going to sit here and sip my coffee with a saucer and read the paper. <laughs> read the paper. What? There's simpler times. Maybe uh, it's may- a connection to a simpler time. Yeah. Maybe. I mean, seriously, what is the big deal? We're all born naked. You know? Well, I, I'll be honest. I don't want to walk down. I don't want to drive down a street and see a naked person walking out to the to the mailbox. I don't. <laughs> I don't want to see that. Morning, I, Clark. I hope every day I don't have to see that. But why? Why not? The uh, naked human body is a very natural thing. It's all nature, Kelly. Are distracting. <laughs> if you're if you're driving down the street, that's you have telling to see about that. you if you get distracted. I just yeah. don't want. I don't want to wreck. Yeah. All right. So, so Dave, you're saying not a big deal. Don't don't make a huge deal over it. Let it's, him be naked. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it's not a big deal. Tell him, okay, I'm not comfortable with this, so maybe don't walk around my neighborhood naked. Right. It's definitely not something to immediately end a relationship over. Hey, Dave, what area of town do you live in? Uh, I live across the river. I live over in New Albany. All right, so Dave's New Albany neighbors probably have seen a couple things <laughs> <laughs> over at the old Dave house. <laughs> Love that. All right, buddy. Hey, thanks for the phone call. Yep, thank you. No problem. Uh, I will say there are several that are like on Facebook. Bet says, hey, he lacks good judgment and common decency. Pamela says it's time to say bye-bye. He's not going to change. Okay, Jessica is rolling in with that's illegal, right? Like indecent exposure? If he's on his property. So it's fine to be naked outside on your property as long as it's on your property? Or is it in your house? I thought it was in your house. Like if you're in your house and you have your windows open and you're naked and people can see you, the they, police they can't, can't do, do anything. anything about it, exactly. But if you go outside, I feel is like. There, are there any law enforcement that can actually, 
that aren't doing anything serious we right need now. An who, explanation <laughs> of what is can, indecent we, exposure. I mean, just hypothetically, if I wanted to walk outside and and fetch the you know mow my lawn in the nude, could I do that? Okay, asking for a friend. For a friend, obviously. <laughs> Gene's like, oh, snap. I just passed Dave at the end of his driveway. He was waving in all his glory. Was it Dave or Joe? <laughs> I don't know. Um, all right. So uh, anyway. Christina says, it's illegal, Ben, and no one wants that. Okay. All right. Well, yeah. I mean, I obviously um, don't want, want to keep everything legal here, right? Well, yeah. I think the biggest issue here is what if a child were to see that? Okay, right? There's a, That was the one thing that she mentioned. There are, there are kids. There are neighbors. What if someone's driving by at the sure. wrong time and a kid sees that? That That's kind of, I think, where most of us are saying that's the biggest problem in this. Like, so, if he wants to be naked, fine. But it's it's the other people that might see that that doesn't, they don't want to see that. Let's not um, dump the relationship just yet. Let's have the conversation, say, hey, uh, in my neighborhood, let's just... Put some boxers on. Yeah. You know, yes. hey, had he put boxers on and a pair of slippers and walked out and did the same thing, like no one would have batted an eye. Exactly. No one would have batted an eye. All yes. Right. Well, hey, good luck with that. Thank you, Heather, for reaching out to us. That is group therapy.